How's that sound? Oh, you don't know. How are you, mate? I probably should look at the 4EA while we're like into it. The opening day looks kind of smallish. It's around two meters, but clean as a whistle. It's borderline not going to run at box probably for those days, but main rake is going to be good. So they'll probably knock off one of the rounds or whatever they can. Later in the forecast looks pretty good. There's potential of maybe a box day on Saturday. But to be safe, they'll probably just surf Manies and it'll be perfect. It's just going to be rail turns, I think, at Manies most of the time. Underdog man. I'm going 100% on Jack Thomas, mate. He got second in the trials, been surfing with him a bunch, and he looks like he's going to be deadly. If it ends up going over to the box, Jack could go over there and rinse anyone. So he's um, pretty good. And also Jezza. Jezza's a weapon out there. So those two are definitely dark horses. Underdog women. I think Bronte McCauley is going to go ham again. She's um, she's kind of red hot form. Oh, and won the trial. Clean faces out at Margie's. She's going to belt the lineup. Favourites in the men. I think uh, Ethan Ewing is looking so deadly, and I think he can do back to back. Um, he's my top pick in the men's. But then you look at John John and his history here with the waves and the forecast that's coming. It's going to be pretty scary for everyone that comes up against him, so uh, yeah, those two are my pick of the bunch. Favourite in the women? At this stage, I think Molly's hungry to grind it out. I mean, I surfed with her at Karamas and she was lighting the place up, like as good as surfing I've seen from a girl for a long time, doing huge airs, big rail turns, and she's in form right now. Over at the box, she's gonna be sweet. Put them in the box and see what happens. What do you think? Or well, who's your pick? If I pick both winners, I'm getting a thousand bucks USD. That's about four grand Aussie, so I'm <laughs> Cheers to that. Thanks, Dad.